Carl Summer, president of Reliable EVM, has a wealth of machining experience. Having worked as a machinist, tool and die maker, foreman, tool designer, and operations manager, Carl now shares with you from his wealth of experience. Incredible non-contact electrical discharge machining. But before we go and show some video footage of what transpires, I want you to understand what happens with the electrode inside of the cut. And this is the wire electrode, the dielectric fluid that acts as a resistor, and this is the workpiece. Dielectric fluid acts as a resistor until enough voltage is applied. Then the fluid ionizes and sparks occur between the wire electrode and the workpiece. Sparks precisely melt and vaporize the material. And rather interesting, the sparks per second is from 500 to 30,000 sparks per second, but only one spark at a time. Because in wire EDM, the wire never touches the part, otherwise it causes a short circuit, I got an idea. Could I cut this piece of aluminum without clamping? Now this is non-magnetic, this is aluminum. So I took this here piece and laid it on the block and did that experiment. Let's examine what happened. Now this aluminum, which is non-magnetic, is being EDM. We will speed up the cut. We will slow the cut as it EDMs the upright angle. We will speed up the cut again. We will slow the cut as the part falls off. Finally broke free. Now we'll raise the EDM head. Now I'll take the piece off here, as you can see. The wire never contacts the part. It's just the sparks do. And remember, one spark at a time. Incredible non-contact EDM. It also cuts one spark at a time. I did an experiment. I took a quarter inch piece of steel and placed it into a small hole EDM machine and let it cut unclamped. This is what happened. Now the dielectric fluid is turned on. Since the electrode is used, the water coming out isn't perfectly straight. But once inside the hole, it really doesn't matter. The pressure of the dielectric fluid caused the steel to wobble, but it managed to cut a hole into the part without being held. Once the electrode penetrates through, you can see the dielectric fluid squirting out. Since small hole EDM is a non-contact machining method, it can drill holes on curved surfaces. A normal drill one cannot because the drill will walk off. I'm holding the ball bearing with a dime so you could see how small a hole we could drill. That hole is being drilled with a 10 thousandths electrode. Here we show you a video of it cutting into the ball bearing. Now it's beginning to cut into the edge. 
It's a non-contact. The nose is not pushing away because it never, the electrode never touches that ball bearing. Synchro EDM also works at one spark at a time, but it works out of the bottom. So this entire surface is sparky. And so you're going to be watching now. We're going to look at a video of this electrode beginning to EDM apart. Notice the up and down motion of the sinker EDM. The electrode does not touch the part. It, the sparks are jumping rapidly from the electrode to the part. To remove the eroded particles to bring in fresh oil, the sinker EDM keeps pecking along. And so you have that hydraulic pressure occurring. My son, who's a mechanical engineer, and I have written this here book, Complete EDM Handbook. It's loaded with all kinds of EDM information, and it's free on our website. Located in the heart of the high-tech energy capital of the world, Reliable has the largest EDM job shop capabilities in North America, specializing nationwide in wire, RAM, and small hole EDM. Our commitment to our customers and our passion for technology has made us the EDM specialists.